miss layup there. And here's Helter Brand to Kagiwa and Kagiwa. <laughs> That's lovely. <laughs> Up, step, and jump. <laughs> Nagalangan siya, he wanted to take the shot, but there was a defender in front of him, so he took that extra step before giving up the pass. The fast to the furious to the turnover. Gusto niyan tumira dito. He's looking at the basket. Kaso may defense yun. Agad-agad tumulong din si Daniel Defonso. Meantime, here's Jonas Villanueva. Arwin likes this matchup. Has the height advantage over Ronald Tubin, but he comes up short. Peña slams to the floor. And here comes Ginebra on the run. Here's Tubin. Tubin. Back outside. Helter Brand for three. Yes, sir! They're fast <laughs> to the fearless to the fast and Inebra races ahead 39-31 back in a moment and now you know why there is a big smile on Dr. J's face all the way till Christmas Day. Kala ko sinabi niya akin ka. Ah, Dr. J, ha? Yun yun ang pagkarinig ko. Ano magagawa ko? Oh, nakatalikod. It is Otiveros to Freeman. Freeman back on the floor and Freeman will miss. And here comes Tobit. Tobit. Crossover dribble, steps on the brakes, outside the Yancey, Yancey, layup, no go, blocked by Freeman. Great timing there by Dave Freeman. And here's Otiveros for three. Straight, but uh, just a tad bit too strong. Hatfield came into the ball game to replace Rico Villanueva. Put together with Yancey de Ocampo, really held their ground on defense no, for uh, Baron Gallinebra earlier. No? Hatfield handoff to bit off the glass. Medyo lumalaki na itong lamang dito ng Hinebra. Sampung puntos na ito. No? 8 minutes and 36 seconds is a lot of time. But they have made a lot of defensive stops on the other end. That's the key. They're taking a double-digit advantage. This Jonas Villanueva cannot get rid of Helter Brand. Here's Arwin Santos. Flips it in. Felt the body contact. And uh, he will go to the free throw line. So the foul is on uh, Yancy De Ocampo. Second personal foul here on Yancy De Ocampo. Obviously, if you're a defensive team, you don't like that call being made against you. Not the fact that uh, you're establishing for a charging, but you've established position and it's the offensive player coming and causing the contact. So, we being let go. That's a referee. We see the foul. It's okay also. That's their decision. That's a judgment. So we have Eric Nick who's got a pretty good rest Take, uh, taking out Yancy Di Ocampo. Big man of uh, Barangay Hinebra playing really well in this ball game. Eric Nick had 10 points in the opening court. And Arvin Santos goes 2 out of 2. Let's go to Leah Cruz. All right, thanks, Miko. This is pretty interesting. I spoke with Coach Shot Nakinsen earlier about how he keeps his band of superstars motivated, and he says their objective every game is to play to the best of their potential. Wins and losses are just an offshoot of this. They try not to play based on the opponent or team standings because they tend to relax when they do that. Now he does this because his players are all stars, and they're very competitive. So if they don't perform well, then he has to among the teammates nila because they know that the other guys all want to and can't play. Miko and Dr. J. Well, action has been ferocious among this batch of all-stars. And here's Kagiwa. Kagiwa, breakdown move! You know, Mark doesn't take as many shots as he used to for this team. And there are many instances in this game tonight that I saw his teammates could have given him the pass. He was open. But he has not been complaining. You know, he just takes it all with a grain of salt. He just plays. Right now, it's a 10-point game in favor of Inebra. Oh, nice pass. Perfect drop pass. Yan ang sinasabi natin na capital L ni Danny Ildefonso. Which means? Le le not Leah, yeah, leadership. Leadership, yes. Leadership. Yeah. Leadership, leadership. Importante yan. We have, a new, we have a new leader. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Eight to shoot. Nenk. Double team. And he loses the ball. And here's the ninja. 
who missed the layup earlier. He fires open shot. It's good. It won't be that easy putting San Miguel away. <laughs> the Beerman cutting that deficit down to six points. Back in a moment. Oh, meron da uh, meron tayong tanong, Dr. J. Para sa iyo. Ano ito? Uh, mula kay uh, mula sa kanila. Teka sa dali. <laughs> mula sa kanila. Magandang magandang gabi po. Ah, sa so inyong lahat. That's Miss Valerie Concepcion. Ay, kasama natin. Moni Lagan, the Honorable Moni Lagan. Hey, you're a fan of you. And uh, of course, uh, uh, Lisa, Lisa huh? Barakiel. Yan. Ako, hindi ako mahihap. Dinoto ko yan. <laughs> Atin-atin lang ako rin. <laughs> okay, but let's go back to the question. May tanong dito from Miss Lina Antonio. Uh, gusto niya malaman from you, Dr. J. What, what is your uh, thoughts? Uh, what are your thoughts? Kasi uh, nagkaroon tayong power shift dito. No? Yung talk with Texas, lumakas no? because of the yeah. addition of Kelly Williams and Ryan Reyes. Correct. San Miguel, malakas na since day one of the yeah. season, day one yeah. of the tournament. Yeah. Ginebra is, uh, is getting there. No? They, they have a loaded team. That's yeah. not a question. It's a fact. It's a fact. Yeah. Now, when you look at these three teams and the way they're playing, yeah. you are impressed the most with which team? Yan tanong from uh, Lina Anton. Well, right now, if you look at the games, talagang the way they have been demolishing uh, the other teams, you would say Talking Texas on a rise. Uh, before that, it was San Miguel. No? Uh, ito naman, believe ako dito sa Hinebra dahil, ito kita mo, wala yung import nila kanina for so many minutes, but they continue to be able to take the lead and even increase the lead. So, can you imagine if they have, if they change import and get a better one? Or if they had a great import from the start. Yeah, well, Okay, and it's not how you start for me, it's always how you finish it. You know, uh, I think that, that's been proven in the NBA. <laughs> and that's good to, that has been proven in the PBA with the championship of Pure Food Slash Masakit Conference. Masakit naman if you're like a Cleveland fan. Oh, wala, masakit talaga yun. <laughs> Even Orlando, yeah, yeah. nangihinalo na rin, pero bukas, eh, bukas, eh, bukas, eh, bukas ang laro sa bahay nila, baka may chance pa yan. Tapos now, nagating yung import, makikihalo pa ng ganyan. <laughs> so, right now, you know, even Derby, Darby H is also a strong team, pero marami lang kulang kasi wala si Derby. May on counting injury si James. Alaska is pretty strong. Uh, they've gotten back uh, on the right track after a faltering start. So, there are many teams here that can win this, this championship. Ang pinaglalabanan dito ngayon, in this elimination round, is to be number one and two para dalawa na lang sila ang lalaban sa service pa. Now here's Freeman. Kabagno, that ball will go back to Freeman, and Freeman will finish. Still a two-point lead para sa Inebra, 46-44. Whoa! Big collision by, between Meng and Pinisi. And they go to Meng at the post. And here's Ambrose, and he misses. Rudy Hatfield is blocked. <laughs> action has been absolutely fierce. Uh, this is the first half. Well, I think the energy. Like I said, a lot of people have always said these are sister teams. They may not compete on that level. But it's been proven. I've been, I've, I've been watching them for how many years? I know they don't like each other when they play on the floor and they just compete against each other uh, in a terrific manner. And of course, you, you know, that is validated by tradition. You go, you go all the way back to, let's say, the time when the, all those epic battles between Norman Black and uh, Senator Jaworski. Yeah. When San Miguel and Hinebra would uh, face off. Uh, this second free throw brought to you by DMX Derby's Premium Formula, Dito Kana Sal Yamado. Well, they were supported by their management. That's the important thing. Then after that, bahala na kayo. Pagbutihan nyo na, di ba? <laughs> Pagalingan na kayo dyan. Oh. But Antimano, what you ask for, we, we try to help you, we give you. And after that, bahala na no, kayo. We give you the tools yeah. to succeed, but it's it's all up to you. When you're there on the court, yeah, kayo the, na yan. The players and the coaches are the ones who does it. I think the same way, for example, with the PLDT franchise. No, ganun mo naman ang sa kanila. 48-44. Yep. Ito, biglang uminit naman dito si Ambers. 
Kanina pa siya nanonood lang sa bench and all of a sudden, sumali na rin siya sa shooting dito. He's got 7 in the ballgame now. And that extends the members lead to 6 points, 50-44. Now here's Kabagdot pulling up off the mark. Ambrose with a rebound. 